Okay, this is an interesting text completion. So let's find a quick way to do it. Notice the first blank. It can be amazes or pleases or something positive. Or it can be this mystery word nettles. You can almost bet that this mystery word nettles has to be something negative, as they wouldn't put three positive words for one blank. So there is nothing either positive, but let's just say it pleases scientists. So if that's the case, then what will the reaction in the third blank be? Well, if nothing pleases them, well, just think about the pleased reaction. Now let's jump to the answer choices in blank number three. We have contemptuous. That means full of hate. So let's write that down. Here's G, a negative emotion. H, indifferent is neutral. You don't care. But we're either going with a positive or a negative for the first blank, so they care. Insincere is, well, it's obviously not positive. It's somewhat negative, but definitely does not, it's not positive. And so we can say, hey, wait a second. None of these words are positive, meaning that A and B cannot be the correct answer, meaning it has to be this negative word. And that word is nettles, which means to irritate or upset. But even if you didn't know that, you should be able to figure it out working backwards from the third blank. And this also shows us that we shouldn't always be rooted into the first blank, saying, oh, it must be here, only here, must, can we, must we come up with an answer before we venture on? No, work between the blanks. See which one's easiest to come up with and see what the relationship between the blanks is. So that said, we know it's nettles and we know it's something negative. So we have a strong word here is contemptuous. It upsets scientists. So there's nothing more upsetting the scientists, more nettling or irritating than when these paleontologists, they give this example here, these two guys come up and solve this problem that they weren't able to do. So it's upsetting. And so the reaction, therefore, is some strong negative word. And that's why circle contemptuous. There it is. This isn't serious and strong enough. Finally, going back to that first sentence, once we've plugged in nettles, what is that? Because the second blank is saying, if you doubt this what? This what? This comment, this observation, this description of reality, this phenomenon, whatever you want to call it. And therefore, F is our best answer. Objurgation is extreme scolding or a rebuke, a harsh rebuke. So that doesn't make sense. And exposition is just, a just when you describe a theory at length. The first sentence is simply an observation, not an exposition. And just like that, we have our three answers.